Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for watching. So today's story I'm going to show you how to create this beautiful neutral cut crease. It's a really dramatic look. So I recommend this look to use at night in a wedding or a prom. This look is wearable for everybody in every skin tone. That's it. I hope that you enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you still didn't. And follow me on Instagram to see more pictures of my work. As always, do not make this video so long, I already prepped my skin. So in my skin, I used the Professional Primer by Benefit. A few drops of this rose gold for Sally oil. I also used one of my favorite foundations, the Forever by Dior. And now I'm gonna start my eyes. I'm using this Insurance Primer by Too Faced. I'm applying with a clean finger all over my lids. This will prevent my eyes from creasing and make all the shadows less. And to Today I'm gonna use this palette that is a dream. This is the Chocolate Bar Same Switch palette. Oh my god, this palette is everything. So using an angled brush and this medium brown eyeshadow, I'm gonna create a cat eyeliner in my outer corner and this will help me to guide all the shape of this makeup look. And then I'm gonna trace a line above my crease using the same brush in the same brown eyeshadow. I like to do it with my open eyes so I can see what I'm doing and make sure the cut crease will look beautiful even with the open eyes. So I go adding a little more of this eyeshadow, filling the outer corner. This makeup is a little more complicated. Make sure they look the same when you open the eyes and when you close it too. I just changed the brush for a really small fluffy brush. I'm using the same medium brown that I was using before. Just make sure to blend this eyeshadow to the top and not to the bottom. This will create a beautiful transition of colors and make the space in the eyelids really clean. Oh my god, this palette smells so good, just like a chocolate. I love chocolate and I love this palette as well. This is so cute. Now, using a normal eyeshadow brush, I'm gonna use this cream color to highlight my brow bone. I want this look completely matte, so you can use any shimmer eyeshadow if you prefer. Using this medium fluffy brush, I'm gonna apply this really warm brown eyeshadow. I'm gonna blend this color between the medium brown that I applied before to create the cut crease and the eyeshadow that I just applied to highlight my brow bone. This will be my transition shade, but you can apply this color before of everything. This will help you to guide the makeup. For example, if you need something that will give you more control to draw the lines in the eyelid, it will help your eyes to look the same. Now, using the same color that I applied in my brow bone and the same brush, I'm gonna apply this color in my tear duct area. This eyeshadow is matte and work really well. Now, using a fluff angled brush, I'm gonna use this light brown eyeshadow and I'm gonna apply it in my eyelid. So this will create a beautiful gradient of colors. Now I'm using a short shader brush and I'm gonna apply the same medium brown in my lower lash line. I'm gonna apply just a little bit of product. 
And now I'm gonna line my eyes using the gel eyeliner in the color Wicked by Sigma. I love this gel liner because it's waterproof and dries matte. You can skip this step if you want, but I'm doing just a little cut eye in my eyes. I don't wanna make it look so heavy or hide the beautiful colors and gradient of the cut crease. All the brushes that I'm using are from Sigma as well. You can use my code MelissaSB for 10% off in any purchase that you do in the SigmaBeauty.com. Now you can go ahead and apply your fake lashes and mascara. I'm using the Style Show Fluffy by Velour Lashes. And to finish my skin, I'm using the blush Berry Amore by Milani. I love the shade of blush. As I'm doing everything neutral inspired in the chocolate, I'm applying this beautiful neutral shade of blush. And to highlight my face, I'm using this stunning highlighter by Too Faced, the Candlelight Glow. I'm using the shade Warm Glow and oh my god, look at this. I don't know if you can see in the camera, but in real, this is amazing. And for my lips, first I'm gonna conceal to cover the natural shade of my lips. I'm using as always the Lip Concealer by Sigma, I'm the shade Lose the Halo. I love this stuff because moisturize the lips and have a kind of medium covered, so I love it. And for lipstick, I'm using this new shade from Lime Crime, I love this color. I just love all the colors and the texture of these liquid lipsticks, they are amazing. I'm using the color Buff, this is one of my favorite liquid lipsticks and they last super longer in the lips. And that's it my lovies, thank you so much for watching, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe and I see you in the next videos. Bye!